If you see someone flying a kite on a rainy day, then you must be careful, because it can create an accident silently with just a small movement. An assassin organization has received a new target, an old man in a wheelchair. The employer is the old man's own son, who is trying to cheat him out of his insurance money. Based on the target's routine, the organization learns that Alex pushes the old man to and from work daily. After investigation, Stephen and the others set the location on the highway in front of Alex's store. After further sophisticated analysis and projection, they finally came up with the idea of using the tram track current to connect with the power lines in the sky, and it could only work on a rainy day with a wet kite string. When everything was ready, the operation began on a rainy night, and Alex continued to push the old man into the street as the rain poured down. People were in a hurry and no one noticed the impending murder. Aim wraps the kite string around a power line and drops it down, but Gary, being old with Alzheimer's fails to remember that it should have blocked the camera with a balloon, but the downpour is a rare occurrence and greatly reduces visibility on the street. Stephen decides to continue the operation, and Mark Spike intentionally scrapes Alex, who is pushing the old man, whose wheelchair loses Alex's grip and slides backward right into the kite string hanging down from the power line, and is electrocuted to death. The murder was a success, and everyone quickly evacuated the scene, but then a bus suddenly loses control and swerves into Stephen on the side of the road. He reacts in time and dodges, but another passerby and Mark on his bike are not so lucky. The bus crashed into the two men, and Mark died on the spot. Stephen quickly searched Mark's cell phone and wallet, and when he returned home, he found that his house had also been ransacked. 